All right, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to tell you about my haul that I did today. I am so proud of myself. I went to Joanne Fabrics and I only wanted to get one thing because I want to make my own, save the dates and my own invitation. So I was like, okay, I have a 40% off coupon. I'm gonna go in there and get that one thing. Well, we all know that never ever happens, right? So I ended up walking out the store um, and spent $30 but I saved a lot. So I'm gonna go over what I bought, okay? So first, I bought these gold, pretty gold paper. They're gonna be part of my invitations. I actually bought three of them. They were $1.29 each. Next, I bought pretty blue paper. Now these were 20 cents each. I love when they have sales and I can just go crazy. I bought a bunch so that way I'm all ready. I'll probably go back and buy some more. And then I bought this pretty wine color. I say that like that because my bridesmaids um, I wanted apple, but then when we got there, it was really, really red, and I was like, no. So, we chose this color, which at David's Bridal is wine. So, that's what I'm just going to keep calling. So, we bought, I bought this wine. That's also going to be part of my save the dates and my invitations. Then, I got a tracing pad. So, this I'm actually going to use for my save the dates I'm gonna have a picture and then I'm going to put a picture and I'm going to put this over top and it's going to say um, save the date for Ashley and Harold's wedding and the date and then you can kind of like flip it up and then we'll be a picture underneath so you can kind of see both I think it looks really awesome I seen somebody else that do it that did it and I can't wait so I have that Ooh, this I think is my favorite thing so at my best friend's wedding and her bouquet she had a bunch of like brooches and stuff put on her bouquet and I loved it so I decided to replicate that a little bit and me and her have this thing about butterflies I have tattoos of butterflies I've just been in love with butterflies so I actually have like a heart that's um, a butterfly part of a butterfly um, but anyways so I found this and it actually works perfectly because it's actually like a gold color. So it works perfect with my color scheme. I'm going to put this in with my bouquets. Well, in my bouquet, not the one that I'm throwing. Um, I plan to get a couple other ones, um, maybe like a little Beauty and the Beast theme something kind of brooch. But I want it to be not cartoony. I love the new Beauty and the Beast. I'm very obsessed with it. Um, so I want it to be something like that. So I gotta keep looking, but this was only six dollars, and I had a forty percent coupon off. So that's a win. Um, then I bought um, double-sided tape because I'm gonna need that for my invitations. I bought a hole punch, but what's different about this hole punch is that it is very, very tiny. So it's very, very tiny because on the top of my save the date, I'm gonna put a hole punch. And then I'm going to put a fastener so that way they can lift up the tracing paper and see our picture underneath. Um, it was a really cool idea and this was only $5 and again, another 40% off coupon because I'm all about coupons. This, I actually went to Joanne Fabrics to get a um, paper cutter. So when I went there, I found one for $10. Okay, that's fine. I, that was a steal to me. Um, it was 50% off. It was originally, I think, a $17 um, cutter, a paper cutter, awesome deal. So then I went over to Hobby Lobby because I had a 40% off coupon there. So I was like, oh, let me see what I could find. Went down the aisle and of course found another paper cutter. But this one is actually a lot cheaper. So I spent $10 at the one at Joanne Fabrics. I spent $6 at this one at Joanne Fabrics. I think at Hobby Lobby, so I'm getting those confused. At Hobby Lobby, I spent $6 for this one. This is an originally a $27 paper cutter I got for $6. And it's even bigger and it comes with more stuff. So I think that was a great steal. Look how big this thing is. 
I think this will do everything I need it to. So that is everything that I bought. And then when I was at, um, sorry, I'm getting them all confused. When I was at Joanne Fabrics, when, however many items you bought, you got a bunch of free stuff. Um, so they had this table set up. And at the table they had like flowers and I don't know. It was like 4th of July stuff and different things. So I got to pick stuff. Well, look what I got for free. Mm -hmm. I got three of these little planters that have a pretty rose on it. They actually have two. These planters are originally $8 and I got it for free. I got three of those. I can always use either the greens or the flower for the bouquet. I just thought that was cool. Then I got some of these. I mean, they're very wedding me, right? I can put them in the bouquet. I can get more. But that was cool. Um, then I got a bunch of white roses. Let's see. How many did I get? I got one, two, three, four, five. Six, six things of white roses so I thought that was really really cool um, because I can cut them up so that way my entire bouquet isn't red I can put other colors because I plan to make homemade flowers out of like fabric and out of paper so that way it looks really cool um, I can't wait to show you guys how I put that together um, and then I got two more of these roses I thought they were cool. I mean, they're kind of wide, wide, and you could tell they're a little fake. Um, but I just thought they were cool. Something to throw in there to give it a little different color and a little different texture. So, I mean, why not, right? So, at Joann's, at my haul today, I should have spent $89. That does not include the flowers because I don't know how much the flowers cost. Um, but $89 I should have spent. And I ended up walking out with all of that stuff for only $29. That is a $60 savings. I am so excited. And with me making my own wedding invitations and my own save the dates, I'm saving hundreds. And I am so excited. And over the next couple months during cheerleading, I plan to put them together. And I can't wait. Alright, another thing I wanted to show you guys is, have you ever ordered off a wish? Well, this is my first time, and I was really excited. I found some flowers, they were like $3, like 74 I thought it was going to be like this little tiny flower. Well, not little tiny, but I mean, a nice size flower. I could put them on the case, right? So I was so excited. Ordered them. I said I didn't really care if they didn't come in for like a month or two, because I heard wish is really slow at um, delivery. I didn't care if they came in in a month or two because my wedding isn't for like eight months. Well, let me tell you what I got. Instead of like quarter size flowers or, you know, that I expected, I did not get that. Instead, I got this. So it's a little tiny, apparently you have to read the description, which I did not. I just looked and thought that was really cool and bought it and didn't really care. So these are foam pieces and it has like a little tiny polka dotted, um, um, can't think of the word. Anyway, I can blow a mesh around it and like a little tiny stem. I don't think these are going to fit in my bouquet very well. What do you think? But I did come up with a really cool idea um, to give them away and use them as like a tie for my candy basket, uh, my candy bags that I plan to give away to my guests. So, eh, I guess I have to order more off a of wish. But, that's okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the moral of my story for tonight before I go to bed is if you want something for your wedding, Go out, coupon, research. Um, don't just go into a store and buy whatever and pay full price. Because if you can see, I haven't paid full price for anything in my wedding besides um, my photographer. And 
I have to have her at full price. But everything else, I have bought at a discount. And I am loving it. And Harold is loving it because I am saving so much money. And that makes him happy. And that makes me happy. So, stay tuned to my next video.